welcome back for another episode of Diablo 3. We got ourselves an ancient rhyme heart at the end of the last episode, which is hilarious and terrible. Uh, we put the difficulty up to Torment 8, so we're going to be carrying on with that uh, just as soon as my brother is ready. Anything could happen. Um, um, yeah, just rifting? a regular rift. I suppose yeah. you're still pansy. Yeah. I mean, suffering. Not, well, not... Fragile. Fragile. Yeah. Hello? Anyone worth my attention? Oh jeez, yeah, you move so quickly. Power oh, pylon. you missed some blues. Well, I didn't go there. That's not really missed. That was not near, ever. You went around this bit. I didn't see them. <laughs> so funny. They couldn't have been that important. Where were they? I killed them. Oh, there. No, I didn't actually go on this. Hit. I was around the north edge. Yeah, but they came. They came from like the uh, the gap in between. It doesn't matter anyway. It was just a uh, just. Funny. You're wrong, and I'm right, and that's the important thing. Well, I've already got a set amulet, so hopefully it's going to be the one I want. Uh, the uh, litany of the undaunted. <laughs> As an amulet, yeah, I would take that. I'm not sure I would. Like, what would you put in its... Actually, no, I totally would. Need more yeah. <laughs> there was a really good suggestion, actually, um, that I read on some forum. Uh, I can't remember when it was, but it was like forever ago. Oh, what it was. But it was like for a new recipe to transfer the red text from one unique to another. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah. And I was like, ooh. And it could, yeah, it could be like Not ready quite like, super powerful. Yeah, it really could. But, you know, the, the whole concept being that it would be quite expensive, obviously. Um, but you mm. could take some things that you would love to be able to run together and actually run them together at the expense of something yeah. else in a different slot. I could see it becoming quite overpowered, so it would probably have to be scaled according to the slot it got moved to. Um, like what? Well, um, uh, belts, for instance, normally have lower affixes than uh, other positions. Do they? Well, in terms of red text, because that's what we're talking about. No, uh, maybe not in terms of, uh, of red text, but um, all other affixes. Um, so, uh, just general stats. So... That would give people um, some flexibility in where they wanted it. So if you wanted to say something really powerful, um, like, let's say Rhymeheart was good, and uh, you wanted it in your belt slot, it might scale it down from 20% yeah, like to that's a, that's a good example, actually, right? Rhymeheart in a belt slot. Perfect. Like, my current build has kind of got middling belts. I could do without the Infinity Vault. That's just convenient. That doesn't actually really help me. Hmm. But if I wanted to build a Rhymeheart thing, then I've got to either sacrifice Carly's point or Dawn. And I don't want to sacrifice yeah. either. Dawn on a belt slot. Oh yeah, the, the, <laughs> the condition was you could only have one equipped at a time. So it's okay. not like you could just pick and choose anything. It was like you could yeah. put one on. There's some uh, blood shards Ooh, blood for you. Thief. Yeah, that's going to be very hot. Oh my god, there's so much, so much poison. Thought for a second my internet connection was crapping out, but no, I just inadvertently run out of hatred. <laughs> why am I not moving? Did I do something? Oh no, it's like why am I not shooting? Shoot, shoot! Oh, ah, yeah, that. Oh, a set thing over there. Wherever. It... Thanks. Set gloves. Yeah, I open chests. That came from a chest? Yeah. That seems wrong. Since when was treasure <laughs> ever kept in chests? Like, I always said that if someone had a magic sword, right, you wouldn't find it in a chest or on their mantelpiece. No, you'd find it in their hands. No, you'd find have... it in a stone. <laughs> no, you'd have to pry it from their cold, dead hands. No, no, no. The, like Titan the, Quest, right? When you find... The slightly wet hands of a lake lady. 
Like, I love that's that in Titan find. Quest. When you find the uniques, right, you've got to kill a bad guy that's currently using it against you. And it's like, some of the better ones are like, oh my god, this is the worst thing ever. And then you get it and it's like, oh, this is only moderately powerful. <laughs> I, I do think that that's something that Grim Dawn missed out on, is you didn't really come up against mobs that had items you could steal in that way. The Grim Dawn. Do you also say the Facebook? Shut your face. That's a yes, isn't it? No. Unless I'm, like, actually mocking it. Oh, uh, did you see my update I posted to the Facebook? I need to go back. Oh, my God. So, I got two set amulets. Yep. So? Neither of them are the one I want. Of course not. Uh, what are these gloves I got? No idea. They're a thing. That is such a joke. Uh, such a massive joke. I don't know. Mm, yeah, mm, probably just salvage all of those. So I upgraded my Tal Rash's allegiance. Yeah. To another one because I got two more Tal Rash's allegiances. Well, Tal Rasha gets around. These are just different secret organizations that Tal Rasha was part of. Uh, I got Roland's Grasp. It's basically his wanking hand. Oh dear. He likes the uh, the feel of the gauntlet. Don't we all? No. Shudder. No, shudder. Mmm. <laughs> Manifers. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is too expensive. It's the uh, um, the French articulated gauntlet. <laughs> of course, you would go for the French articulated version. <laughs> At least I'm, I'm pretty certain they're called manifers. Uh, broken promises. The one thing I already have in the queue, but you can go. <laughs> the one thing I already have in my life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Greater Rift. Whatever you feel like. I am keeping it at this for the moment. Because that was a little hairy at times. Enjoy! Ooh, no. <laughs> that looks like fun! <laughs> that that was my second teleport as well, so it was like, nope! <laughs> Noping right out of there. Oh, can you imagine a, like, a meme RPG? Where teleport is just called nope. Um, yeah, that, wouldn't that be um, uh, Kingdoms of Loathing? Yes, I suppose. And Taunt is just called, you mad, bro. Uh, I wonder if Kingdom of Loathing is still going. Oh, of course it's still going. Something like that will never die. That doesn't necessarily mean it's still going, you know. Just like, it doesn't because mean it's, it's iconic, doesn't mean that it will exist forever. Not ready yet. I hunt the Wampus is still around. Uh, next area? Uh, yeah, I'm just catching up. Won't be long. You see, you do that with your belt, and I think that there's something interesting there. So I use my big spells on it, and it's just your blinding field. <laughs> see, when you say I'm using my belt, you know what I'm thinking? <laughs> I'm thinking you mean... No, the... Daddy, no. No, I'm thinking you mean the vaulting, which I get for free from my belt. I... No, no, uh, the... Uh... Because you're using Court of the Sherma, aren't you? I am, as another belt. I'm wearing two belts. Yeah. Exactly. So that's the belt that I'm talking about. When there's that ring on the ground that looks like it could be a time dilation or anything else. Missile dampening. Yeah. Too bad, so sad. Etc, etc. Words. Boom. 
This is going fine. Hey, we met up again. And you're still alive. Hi. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm doing all right. Good work. Oh, jeez. Ah! <laughs> you opened the door I teleported in. It was bad in there. Yes, I, it was I bad in there. I recommend being in there. I threw knives <laughs> through the door. It was fine. And then the bad was no more. <laughs> Once again, it was my second teleport. So I was just like, nope. Get the hell out of there. I mean, I would have survived because I would have died. And then I would have got the... Uh, um, Resurrection. The res. And then you've still got another death, don't you? Yeah, but that one doesn't heal at all. Still waiting. The wizard's cheat death is terrible, in my opinion. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, wave of force. Wow. You could have just cast that. Yeah. I, well, it doesn't. It also doesn't stop all projectiles that are coming at you. And it doesn't stop things that are on the ground. So, if there's a lot of damage being done on the ground, yes, you've got that shield that protects you. I imagine it also bit. probably doesn't stop juggernauts. Yeah, it doesn't. So, if you've got two charging at you, you can be two hit. Ah, that's fine. You didn't want to live anyway, did you? Do you want to kill him? Nice. Good work. He only half killed you. Well, I mean, that was fine. Two-handed swords, gloves, source. Two two-handed swords, actually. Uh, scourge and um, corrupted ashbringer. So a four-handed sword. I would love to dual wield them as a mage, but no. <laughs> Just I don't duct think that's tape gonna the happen. Hand, the pommels together. <laughs> I'm Darth Maul. <laughs> Darth Maul, more like. these Garrigan levels in. Kadala, give me some more rings. No, don't care for those. Homing pads, don't care. Sunkeeper, don't care. Yang's recurve, don't care. Uh, Marauder's visage, I shall keep. Yeah. I like Corrupted Ashbringer, but it's just no use at higher levels. Well, it's the sort of thing you sort of dump on your Templar and forget about it, isn't it? Yeah. And then occasionally wonder so. why you've got skeletons following you. <laughs> Winter Flurry can go in. The rest can get salvaged. Uh, let's talk to Kadala about rings. Ring, 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 ring. Oh, Kadala. Salvage, salvage. Gone, gone. I think I went through that entire greater rift without remembering to activate gloom. Which is like an extra 50% damage reduction or so. Well, we know you're quite tanky. Now we also know you're quite foolish. Came over to save you. Uh, entirely unnecessary. You came over to mock me. No, I came over to save you. Here be monsters. Here be monsters. <laughs> you didn't even tag in the right place. You're a useless navigator. There ish be monsters. That's kind of accurate though, isn't it? How part on. Yeah. Terrible riff though. Yeah, it's uh you're being very slow. Well, I'm sticking with you because it's such an <laughs> awful rift. Would you prefer me to just find the next area? No, no, no. It's, uh, it's fine. You, you've used your excuses. Frenzy Shrine. This, this is a terrible rift. You're being quite slow, you know. I'm always slow. Seriously, where is anyone? Anyone worth killing, I mean, not 
not this trash that <laughs> not, I'm Not the of. pack of mobs that you've just run past. I'm skipping quite a lot. Oh, here we go. Here's someone. Still waiting. And also the next area. Okay. I'll be there as soon as I can. Ah, oh, goblins. I'm waiting. Or at least a goblin. Killing tomb roaches with bowlers. Seems inefficient from the sounds of it. Not ready yet. Like if someone came to you and said they had a roach infestation, you wouldn't go around with the, with some bowlers and just be like, right, I'm going to take them out. Well, only because I'm not an exterminator. If you were, I don't think you would either. I don't know. I am kind of weird. How far away are you? Miles away. Uh, yeah, I, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I've actually come back to get a few more things. Hello. Alright, grab this. Moving on. Ooh. That was the entire reason I slowed down. Ah, oh, because you spotted the gem gold. Well, thanks. I did say! Well, yes, but I didn't think you were actually going to stop, stop, stop for it. Well, I didn't want to risk it being like either another uh, collection of goblins or yeah, something or like a blood a portal thief. or something, yeah. But, well, you don't get portals inside rifts, so it would never be that. No. Well, not inside Greater Rift. So. In fact, no, you can inside regular No, you can't. Right? Only in Adventure Mode. Ah. Well, bounties, I suppose, really. Because this is Adventure Mode, but you know what I mean. Yeah, I, I, I got what you meant. If only they could see me now. Double Death Breaths. Right, coming down. Power pile on. Enjoy. Yeah. Death's breath on me. Yeah, there's going to end up being loads in this place, isn't there? Yeah, it's a very white out place, though. <laughs> Find an interesting mob. There's one. Found an interesting mob. I almost killed him for you. I took him down <laughs> to like one health. I'm impressed that he survived. <laughs> I'm impressed I got the killing blow. <laughs> but then I stopped attacking so that you could. I thought that would be a nice thing to do. Oh, yeah. Um, back to town. It was all you. Better believe it. It's all about me. It's all about me, baby. Oh. Oh, Ice climbers and another HPS. Ooh, interesting. I've already got St. Archie's Gauge, so these can all get salvaged up. Uh, that's not good, though. But I could re-roll it, possibly, so I will keep it. Yoink. Hey! Oh, nice. That's good. Can I have that? No. Sure. I've just made it in the cube. Oh, okay. So you definitely yeah. can't. Ah, uh, now I don't have enough death breath to put it in the cube. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just need one. Right. Good old troll game. Pools of agony. Where are you going? Pools of agony. Pools of agony. <sighs> Fine, I'll come and help. There you go. There we go. Right, back to town.
I even defended you while you were town portling. Uh, thank you. Unnecessary, but thank you. It's also really not going to increase your survivability at all, so... <laughs> it's not, but before I had the Haunt of Vaxo, which is actually doing nothing. So this is going to increase my damage even more. Yeah, I had the Obsidian Ring of the Zodiac on account of it being really quite good. Yeah, it, I, I would totally take that for being able to put more black holes out, but I haven't found one. Uh, right, I need to salvage one of these up. And Kadala, let's uh, let's carry on. To no, let's talk amulets now. Mm. No, I need rings. I need the halo of Arlis. Lucky you. Well, I asked for two rings and I got two rings. Nice. I don't think I have rituals. Well, do you want to use your puzzle ring, ring now? Me. And you can see how you feel uh, in yeah. the fight against greed. Because I've got two others, don't forget, as well. You in? Yep. Probably should have re-geared for gold fine, but uh, I think there'll be plenty of gold by the time yeah, we're done. Yeah, it's not like we're ever short on gold. Yeah, you keep killing things, I'm going to keep looting. Except that guy, because he was annoying. I killed him. Yes, blood shards. Yeah, this is uh, this is certainly going to be good for the gold levels. There'll be no problem empowering for a while. Yeah, I mean the level that we're running at at the moment, I'm not empowering at all. It's just not worth it. Not ready yet. All right, you ready? Yeah. This is uh, this is going to be relatively easy, I reckon. Yeah, pretty easy. So, what's the lady going to give us? Two wands. Just armor and a helmet. I need to go back. Well, these are that's the unstable scepter and black hand key. Neither of those are good. <laughs> yeah, I've got another Liarx. Cra sorry, broken crown and she misses us nice the thing. Oh wow, that nice. Too expensive. Oh <laughs> my god. Congrats. Um Ooh. Yeah, it's been a while since we uh we actually just farmed her for, for goblins. It's not really worth it when you've got so many rings uh, um to actually stick around and try and get death press out of it. There's much better ways of doing that. No. I guess not. Uh so yeah, I think I think we're using these the most efficient way we can. Oh, Nice. Also. Ah. Oh, you, you <laughs> son of a pencil sharpener. Thanks, Kadala. Cheers. Put that in my cube. You know, so you're not even going to save it for Legacy of Nightmares? Oh, actually, no, you couldn't. No, could you? I will, I will but, put uh, it on and I will put my elusive ring in the cube instead, I think. I'm not sure. I'll, I'll of decide. Of course, to cat. I mean, for, for us, uh, it's... Uh, it's just the way we play because yeah, uh, yeah, we can nah, get it's kind of relatively bit of quickly from the rifts anyway. No, it's actually Especially just way better level. than the elusive ring. That's... I mean, uh, so it doesn't I get it doesn't I've get already... the cooldown reduction, but damage-wise, it is the same. It's already got a socket in, so I can reroll dexterity into like critical hit, critical hit damage instead. Possibly have an improvement that way, or go for cooldown. Um, to be decided at some point, but for now that can just sit around. I yeah. don't need more damage. That can. 
difficult choices, eh? Yes. Um, did you want to increase up to Torment 10? Not up to Torment did 10. Did you want to increase up to Torment 9? Um, before we do that, I think, like, a greater rift that's halfway in between. No, I meant just for the other two puzzle rings that I've got. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that totally Since makes sense. Since that seemed like right. that's what you were talking about a second ago when you weren't... Sorry, I, I was uh, just rambling randomly while I was trying to think of uh, what we could do in there uh, in Greed's Realm. So, let's, uh, yeah, Torment 10. And this will be fine. Well, it'll be fine for me. Right. Probably. Let me uh, just do my... Utility paragons onto gold find. Uh, I'm not. I'm leaving mine on resource cost reduction and area damage. That, that, well, mine was resource cost reduction, and that's it. Because um, I'm not yet 200. So this is giving me 47% extra gold. So probably worth it for me at this point. I'm in. I'm in. You're okay. Uh, You're not dead oh, yeah, yet. Yeah, to totally not dead. I was uh, I was shooting from up top just to be sane. I can actually fire through this. That seems a little unfair for them. Shall I open it? I'm opening it. You're not doing anything on the other side, really. Well, I, I killed everything that was there, so. That was the uh, the whole point in my cunning te technique. Be incredibly unfair. We're getting quite a lot of uniques already. I've got nothing. Just... All right, I've got uh, three uniques. Ha! Huh. Yeah, I've got three yellows. Whoop dee doo. My suggestion: be better. If only they could see me now. Because obviously it's all about the uh, wielder of the weapon rather than... Of course. Rather than the RNG. There is no RNG in this game. Everything is predeterministic. Your face is predeterministic. It's a meritocracy of loot. <laughs> That's the name of my second band, by the way. <laughs> <one. laughs> now, obviously, that's got to be an indie band. Hello and welcome to the worst idea we've had for a while. <laughs> what, meritocracy of loot or...? Ah, oh, that's fine. Fighting greed at Torment 10, because this is, like, easy. I just... I, I just stood a bit closer, so she got hit by all three things rather than just one. I wanted a sword, but I did get, like, uh, 77 million gold. Oh my god. Another yeah. unstable sector. No Ah, oh, let's identify all of this mass amounts of loot that I got. Shut your face. Six. Nice. Ah, oh, here you go. Oh, thank you very much. That is actually very kind of you. And, oh, I got a, I got a different death wish. Which means uh, I've got one to re-roll. Yeah, I don't need any of those. Mm. So I'd have to... Yeah. Okay. Well, let's... Uh, belt, let's maybe? put this over here where it needs to be. This death... Yeah, <laughs> this death wish can stay in here so I remember to re-roll it and this unstable scepter can go. But Kadala, where's Kadala? Give me more rings. I still need that Halo of Arlis. Don't forget, I can't afford that. Changes. That's actually a start. I also needed the Litany of the Undaunted. Well, she obviously knows what you need and not what you desire. And this is actually better than focus, so I'm tempted to wear it at the moment. 
You ready for another greed? Um, not quite. I'll put it in here for now. I'll, I'll sort that out later. Let me just uh, salvage up my stuff. And then we can go right back in. Gone, gone. Oh good, and I can re-roll another Carly's point. And uh, yes, I'm ready. Uh, yes, we're playing Seasons. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Oh, that's going to be so much money. Probably not that much. Well, with the extra percent that I've got. Only about 18 mil. Uh, 23 mil. Fine. Uh, up to yeah. 25 I mean, I'm, mil I'm at now. 29 at the moment. Got some plans doing out all of right? that. Yeah. And that's a yeah, lot. Yeah, I, I don't have any plans lot, left lot of blood to pick chance. up. So. <laughs> yeah, only two, but uh, right. better than nothing. Yeah, definitely not going to need any gold for a while. <laughs> I'm just going to be able to empower everything, whether it's sensible or not. Yeah, I don't empower anything that I've got less than a 30% um, uh, chance to do. Ah, fair enough. If I've got the money to spare, then I probably will, but uh, it depends on what I'm going for and how much time I've got. Because there's no point in having money if you're not using it. I suppose. I mean, it does take me four knives to take her down. Dagger Just and a belt mace. and gloves. Blah. I feel like you should get exponentially more loot each time. Like, the first time you kill her, you get maybe one thing. Yeah. The second time, two. Third time, three. Repeat. Add infinitum. Pig sticker and sunkeeper. Sunkeeper always looks stupid. Pig sticker is stupid. But I got Fleeting uh, Strap right. and Flawless Royal Topaz, which is actually going to be really useful. Shen! Pig Stick is actually really good, by the way. Um, well, no, it's not. Because it's got the most number of primary abilities, so it's, like, really good for specifically, like, Thorn's build, I think. I can't remember exactly, but there's there's one build where it's, like, just amazing. <laughs> um... Crossbone, don't care, don't care. Witching Owl is quite nice for the attack speed increase, but also don't care. Uh, James Harker in chat. Uh, well, I I'm up to 300 mil. I don't actually have an opinion on the Crusader build this season. I'm afraid I've not actually had a look to see who's got top at the moment. Uh, yeah, generally, we don't one chat that much during Monday it. nights because we do record these episodes one in ten chance of later being consumption. Um, but to specifically answer that, I've not actually seen what it is, I'm afraid. No. Right. I'm going to salvage these up. Mm -hmm. But it does come with a 10% reduction in resource cost. Uh, I've had a notification that Pig Sticker can be used for a specific mage build uh, for a Veers one if you're not using Chandotos, which for me seems very strange because I can't imagine the build without it, but I'm assuming that the maths does work out for that. Hmm, that's interesting, but I still think probably not. Try. Although it would be hilarious having the pig squeals going off all the time. <laughs> what a steal. Ah, I just want that halo. The frustration is real. Kadala does not like me. Right, well, um... After all of that uh, puzzle ringing. Yeah. Ringing? ringing? Yeah, sure. Yeah, puzzle um, ringing. That's uh, probably a good point for us to call an end to this episode as well. So thank you very much for watching, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed this as much as we have and will be joining us for the next. Remember to like these videos if you like them and subscribe to our channels if you've not already. And we shall see you next time for some more Diablo 3. We'll see you soon.